So you have a choice as to which stations you visit to balance these reactions, but you must visit at least two stations. So what are your stations? on how do you balance reactions. Template, and then it has a sample one already filled out for you. Using this template form, this chart form, you can plug in one of the questions that you have to balance and then work through the solution this way, using the chart and using the template. So this one allows you to draw particle pictures. If you like drawing particle pictures, this is probably a good station to The third station is poker chips. So again, poker chips, use the poker chips to draw out the reaction you have to balance, and then fiddle with the poker chip until you balance your reaction. You can log on to the computer, go to the website, and use the website to help you answer and find out and balance some of these reactions. stations because you may find that you start looking at one station and it's not so easy if you're having a little bit of a hard time with it well then you can skip to another station and see if that makes things more clear for you or you're working at a station you're thinking oh this is really easy but maybe it's taking you longer than if you used another station so try out different stations try and get a feel for what works best for you so that when you have to balance an equation later on in class or a reaction later on in class you know what method works best for you. Beside the number of the equation you're working on, just make a little note as to what station you used to answer that question. So if I used poker chips for question six, right beside question six, I'll write poker chips. Why did you pick this workstation? Because it was the least busy. <laughs> Go ahead. Yeah, so what are you doing? Uh, balancing equations with templates. Okay, explain. <laughs> why me? Well, why not you? I don't understand. <laughs> well, here, show us. Go ahead, start pointing to your paper and uh, talk to us. So you uh, write down which uh, particles you're using and then um, just sort of go through the steps to What finish. steps? These steps here? Yeah, these ones. You uh, draw how you balance it, you write the names, and write the statements of what you're doing, and then record it all on your worksheet. Okay, and why did you guys pick this work workstation? It just seemed the easiest. So there's CO2 and then we need H2O. So I'll you. There might have to be a total of two. No, it isn't. It's H2. Dumbass. Oh, what question are you doing? Oh, Jamie. <laughs> like I'm doing nothing with electrons. Oh, oh. Yes, I am.